President Donald Trump took to Twitter this morning to respond to the news that Paul Manafort and Rick Gates surrendered to the FBI by falsely claiming his former campaign chairman's alleged criminal activity took place years ago. However, the dates listed in Manafort and Gates' indictment for conspiring against the U.S., money laundering, and false statements range from 2006 through 2017 proving that Trump's deflection of the latest Robert Mueller investigation bombshell is false. Sorry, but this is years ago, before Paul Manafort was part of the Trump campaign. But why aren't crooked Hillary and the Dems the focus? Also, there is no collusion. Tweeted the president this morning sorry, but this is years ago, before Paul Manafort was part of the Trump campaign. But why aren't crooked Hillary and the Dems the focus? Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump October 30, 2017. Also, there is no collusion. Donald J. Trump at Real Donald Trump October 30, 2017. CNN legal analyst Jeffrey Tubin fact checked the president in real time during a CNN segment on his tweets. It's just not true. Obviously, the president can tweet what he wants, but the indictment itself. You don't have to interpret the indictment you only have to read the indictment to see that it says the conspiracy goes during precisely the time when Manafort and Gates were working for the Trump campaign, said Tubin.